What's going on, guys? I know I'm starting this video with my mouth full. That's like the worst idea ever. But I've already committed to it, so it's happening. Um, disclaimer I may or may not have drink some vodka. Drink, drink, drinks, drink some vodka, drink some vodka, drink some vodka. So, just a little late night coding session while we're, uh, while we're drinking. So I apologize for the fact that I did not have two videos out. Um, well, I guess, I guess this video counts for today. So I didn't have a video out yesterday. Um, I, I promise it's not like inactivity or, or anything like that. Um, if you guys didn't know, I'm like a huge NFL fan, Raider fan. Um, and when I say huge, I, I, that's like an understatement. Like, rate, like football is my number one thing. Like, that's, 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 that's my number one thing. And the draft was coming up, so I uh, watched that. And then a ton of unrelated, like, other issues came out in real life. So I just have not been on, 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 on today or yesterday. So that's, that's why there was no video, and that's why you didn't see me. I'm not giving up. I, pro I swear to you, I'm committed to revival. I'm 100% trying to get things going again. I... And so I just I just wanted to say that it's not like a um, you know a thing. So uh, let's let's do this video the best I can with <laughs> to the best of my abilities. Um, drunk Jamie and high Jamie are two different people. So um, enjoy. I guess I, I don't know. Uh, so you look at Raid Point Shop and probably like oh that's cool, or you're probably like what, or you don't care because you quit the server already. Uh, those are the, <laughs> those are the three options. Um, yeah, this is an idea I talked about in one of my last videos, and, um, I was pretty high on the idea. I heard some people, um, and, and again, in the comments of the video, somebody talked about how it's been done before. Um, I don't really pay attention to other servers, uh, for a handful of reasons. One, I don't care. I have no intentions of playing any servers. I'm revival for life. If something happens to revival, I'm quitting the RuneScape private server scene forever. Um, Probably. I feel like I always say that, and then yet you find me like a year later sneaking back into the fucking scene. Anyways, um, uh, yeah, so I, I don't really like paying attention to other servers because I don't want to like copy their shit. I'm a big fan of stand up comedy. Like, I'm a huge stand up comedy fan. And um, one of the things that you just can't do is joke steal. And I feel like a lot of the times that happens, it's not even intentional. Sometimes it's intentional. Amy Schumer, I'm sure she was intentional because she's a piece of shit and she's not funny and needed help to be funny, so she stole jokes. And then there's some other cases where you just you have a similar mindset. And um, if I look at other private servers, I might steal their content, whether on purpose or as an accident. I like to create my own content. I like to be original. I feel like that's what the private server community needs. I know that's not what they want, but that's what they need is, is something different, something unique, and something original. If you want the same damn iCov remake, you're playing them. So, you know, there's no reason to me, for me to tell you not to because you're already playing them. That's what you enjoy. If you enjoy that, go for it. It's a fucking video game. Play it. Have fun. But um, my point is this. I forgot what my point was. Right, 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 right. Be unique. So uh, I don't like to copy other people's ideas, like, knowingly. Now, I will, if I ever take anybody's content or anybody's ideas, I will happily give them credit. I think if you take somebody's ideas, you take some inspiration from somebody else, it's the right thing to do to either ask them for permission or just be a little be a little jerk and just steal it anyways, but at least give them credit. Like, if you just steal it and then claim it as your own, that's, like, the worst thing you can do. Um, so, if you didn't know, this server was based off of uh, the Swords of Vinc Vincillo, 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 and uh, one of the only things I kept, other than, obviously, the core features and whatnot. Oh, I dropped my thing. Other than, like, the core features and whatnot, the only thing I kept was the drop table. I changed the teleports. I changed the, the money pouch. I changed... We changed everything because we wanted to be our, we wanted to be our own server. We didn't want to be vin some Vincillo leech. We wanted to be our own server. We wanted to be revival. And this was the same philosophy going into Dark Asylum. But the drop table was... It's just nice. It's really convenient. It's super nice to be like, oh, I want to go look up a loot hunter. What does a loot hunter drop? Oh, it drops all these dang things. That's cool beans. It's just super nice, and I, I, I couldn't find myself to get rid of it. So that's 100% credit to Vincillo. That is one of the main things I've kept. And um, there's some other things, like the give all command. Give all 40... Oh, whoop. Give all 40... 12. Where did I get that idea from? got that idea from Zamrock. Zamrock, that was one of the things that they did that I really liked. 
I like the fact that they just gave everybody shit. Because honestly, when, you, when you're playing a private server, you're not like expecting some hardcore fucking grind server. You just want to have fun. And I thought that, that was cool that they just, every once in a while when everybody was feeling it, they gave people shit. So that's why I always give people stuff. I have no problems admitting that that was not my idea. I wish it was. I never thought of it. Zamrock. Shoutouts to Abdul. Um, he was a, he was a, he was a good owner. He's a you know he's a weird guy and he's out there, but um, he, you know he he cared about the server more than a lot of other people do in this situation. So shoutouts to him. But uh, yeah, I don't really pay attention to the servers because I don't like stealing ideas. Raid points. I know it's kind of like a, it's, the thing is the reason why a lot of people do it. I'm guessing is because it's it's easy. And real raids is hard to code. I, I, I honestly have never even dab I never even tried because it just seems so hard. Ohm, the mechanics behind Ohm is not even like a real thing. Like Ohm is like a to, to my knowledge anyways, because I could be completely wrong on this. It's like an object and the um or it's not, not an object, it's like part of the map. I don't remember exactly how it how it was worked, but it wasn't like an NPC that you it was like it was either part of the map or it was an object, and you cl what you were clicking was actually like a, a blank NPC. So you weren't even really fighting it. And it obviously has the hands, there's so many mechanics. It was just one of those things where um, I just couldn't do it. And honestly, at this point, Raids 2 is about to happen, so it's not, even, it's not even worth it to spend all that time and effort to code it when Raids 2 is about to be here. My goal is to hopefully try and dabble with Raids 2, whatever it is. I'm assuming they're gonna do something different, but if they do something similar, We'll, um, we'll try our best to get that accurate. So, what I've got in this video for you today, we're seven minutes in and I haven't even said anything worth a damn. Um, so this is the red point shop. That's what you're looking at. 10k points. The scrolls are in here. Pet Gamble for the omelet. Omelet exists. Um, it had some issues. Why is it not... I'm guessing it spawned like in that map and couldn't move. It has a couple issues. Um, it was worse. Trust me, it was way worse. It's at a point now where I'm willing to have it added. Um, let me see if I can proctor what I'm talking about. I'm not sure how to get it to do it. Add that right there, right there. You saw that? That's the issue. It's like a turn animation. I'm not sure what the deal is with that. Um, but all in all, it's not that bad. It, you know, it doesn't look... I'm not a fan of the pet anyways, just because it kind of it just looks weird. It rem oh, that's code. My bad. It reminds me of the dude from fucking Mulan. That little dragon. Eddie, was it Eddie Murphy that, act that, that did the voice? You know what I'm talking about? That little fucking red, red dude? That's exactly what this thing reminds me of. So I was, you know, I'm not really a fan of it, but it, 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 it's better now. And I feel like people want a pet. And this is the pet, so it makes sense. Stop to this bitch. She's right point shop. There's a 5k gamble. If you examine it, you will have a 1 in 100 chance. So, in terms of how to get raid points, you need to kill um, Tecton, Vespula, or Mutado. Those three. Every one will give you guaranteed points. Exactly how many points you get. I don't really want to discuss that in this video, but you will get an amount of points. And again, if you have any suggestions, like suggest them immediately because this update is happening very soon. Um, we're working on one massive update, but we've decided since, uh, I've decided, I don't know why I'm saying we, I've decided that since it's not happening, um, or not happening as quick as possible, I'm gonna release this update now. Because there's things that are coded, like the EZ is coded. The EZ is coded, the new prayers are coded, I don't have prayer points. Um, you're probably looking at this going, oh, what, what is even there? I mean, it's not great. If you have any suggestions, shoot. The, the, the main thing you're looking for is the monster. And you saw the drops from earlier. Uh, you got your same shit, same shit you're expecting. You got your soul to up here. You got everything you're expecting. I'm still trying to. I'm still gonna add some things to it. I actually have a couple ideas, but just um, if you have any suggestions, by all means, shoot. Um, so there's there's a couple things coded, and they're being delayed for no reason other than that the bigger things are, are having you know a slower process. So I decided to split this update into two parts, and this the first part you're gonna receive. Um, I hate promising people dates because it feels like every time I promise somebody a date, it does not happen. But I'm aiming for this weekend. I'm going to try to get it out as soon as possible. Um, and then the second part will happen around the first. If you haven't heard, on the first, we're going to have double RNG day. We'll have another double RNG day on the first. I'll probably talk about that a bit more. 
uh, when it comes out. Um, and there's a couple other updates in this update that I don't want to talk about yet. Uh, mostly just want to go about this update. So uh, let's get into the raids part of it all. So the Tecton... Oh, I just should not have dropped that. My bad. Um, so the Tecton, Vespula, Mutadile, those are all roughly the same. Other than giving you points, which I haven't coded the points yet. Um, well, I haven't coded giving them the points. The points exist, it's just they don't give you them yet. Um, but that doesn't even matter anyway. So those are roughly the same. It's mostly Vasa that has received the big buffs. So let's tell. All right, so let's teleport. You're you're a maxed player. You're going to max cape. You're going to max skill. Uh, go to the orb of light like you normally would. You'll notice something different. Mount Quillamorton. That's where we just were. And you got your shop right here. I'm gonna add a bank chest. I don't think I did it yet. Did I? Did I do it? No, I didn't do it. I'll add a bank chest just for people who need a bank, uh, if you need to. And then, if you want to enter this to fight Vasa, you do not have an ancient ta tablet. Get one, stupid. Yeah, you need an ancient tablet. So, in order to do a Vasa, you're going to need this 2,500-point tablet. Uh, so, let's just pretend like we have the tablet. Um, that's, oh, that's not the ID. What is the ID? What, is, what even is the ID? Tablet. Tablet. 210461. 210461. So we got the tablet. Pretend these. So this box has been massively upgraded. Like, this is not a joke anymore. Like, let me smack it and you'll see how much HP it has. Uh, it doesn't show you how much HP it has because it has so much HP. That's interesting. I didn't notice that. The, the, the little tracker thing here does not go over 10,000, I'm guessing. It has 15k. Its stats are insanely increased. As you can see, with just the blowpipe alone, we're not even touching it. Its stats are uh, crazy. But the thing that's going to want you to kill it, every single person is going to get a loot. And I have not changed the loots. Um, let's just dip out real quick. I'll show you that. I haven't changed the loots. I changed the rarities a bit just because the um, they were higher when they were higher before the uh, the um, nerf of the death darts. And um, honestly, that was probably I mean, it's just one of those things where it's it needed to be balanced better, and and it's balanced better. The dro the loots are about the same. Everyone's gonna get a loot. Obviously, it's hard to prove that on the test server with just myself. I could log into APUG or something like that and kill it with a P ring, but that doesn't really help much. Um, so just trust me on the fact that everyone gets a loot. Everyone has equal like you're. It's it's like if it's like if you killed it by yourself. So if you have luck boosting rings, you can have a chance at the crystal bow and whatnot. And the rates weren't changed much. Don't panic or go. Oh, it's not even worth it. So yeah, boss is gonna be cool. I'm expecting a lot more people to do it. The fact that every single person who is contributing to the kill will get a loot. I definitely plan to mass it whenever this update's out, so you can expect the stream around the time the update's out. Um, wish I had more to show you. As you saw, I couldn't even damage the boss. I'm sure we'll need to adjust things. There's, I mean, it, the, the chances of me just nailing it perfectly on the first try is, is so improbable. Um, so I'm going to test it a little bit myself, and it's obviously easier to test with a bunch of people. Well, we'll see how it goes, but that's the general gist of the idea. And there's a couple other things coming out, too. E-Zone, as you saw. We got um, the raid prayers are getting fixed. There's a nice little bonus update I don't want to talk about. You'll see it. You'll sort of see it. I don't want to talk about it. But I'll just give you a hint. Fortnite. That's the hit. It's something that happens on Fortnite that uh, uh, I'm a big fan of. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. I apologize for no video yesterday. This is kind of counting. Like, it's 11.42 p.m. Oh, is this not my time zone? It's definitely not my time zone. What the hell time zone is this? That's the right hour. It's just not the right minutes. Huh. Anyways, um, yeah. <laughs> uh, this probably doesn't count as today's videos because it's technically being uploaded tomorrow. But uh, either way, fuck it. 